In the world of outdoor gear, knives get slapped with the survival tag more than almost any other product. But with all the static out there, how do you determine which one deserves the title of best survival knife? That's where we come in. Despite what cheerful reviewers and YouTube personalities may lead you to believe, survival isn't supposed to be fun. It's not like bushcraft or camping, where you're out enjoying yourself in the wilderness. Those pursuits are all well and good, but survival is just that. Getting out of a precarious or life-threatening situation with nothing but your wits and the tools you have. Whether you're stranded in the woods with a wrecked vehicle or caught in the suburbs in the middle of a hurricane, you'll want a tough, multi-roll knife that can tackle a wide variety of tasks. In today's video, we're going to take a look at some of the best survival knives for the money. Watch till the end, you'll be amazed. We are sure this list will create a lively debate. K-Bar Becker BK2 Remember this one? K-Bar's Becker BK2 is a repeat performer on Survival Gear's best of lists. And here, it shows its toughness once again, as one of the best survival knives on the market. The Becker BK2 is a 1 pound, 10.75 inch stick of 1095 Crovan steel with a black-coated blade ground flat to five and a quarter inches worth of edge. Its quarter-inch thickness tapers out to a rugged drop point, making it well-suited for stabbing and even light prying tasks. The thick handle comprises two pieces of Zytel, held fast against the full tang by a trio of thick screws. And the knife features an exposed bit of steel at the pommel, which can be used as a hammer or scraping implement. But as impressive as the specs are, they just don't do justice to the BK2's ethos. In hand, this is one of the most rugged, ready, and unbreakable blades in the survival market. It has a broad-shouldered heft that instills confidence in the user, allowing you to power through tasks that would cause hesitation with other knives. Tucked inside its polymer sheath, it rides comfortably at your side and includes lashing points for alternative carry methods. It's a basic, no-frills affair which fits the BK2's attitude. While it may not be the most delicate slicer or readiest fire starter, the K-Bar Becker BK2 is as rugged as they come. If you're looking for something that can smash through bricks and pry open a car door between trips to the woodpile, this knife is for you. SE Laser Strike Few knives have a survival pedigree that can match the laser strike. With its powder-coated 4.75-inch blade, it's a medium-sized knife capable of outshining some fixed blades twice its size. Beyond its outstanding edge, SE added several features to the classic iteration. First, the brand swapped in micarta scales to cover its 5 and a quarter inch handle. These include a bow drill divot, allowing the knife to act as the top half of a primitive kindling rig. But if you're in a more desperate need of a fire, Users can use the attached lanyard washer to remove the flathead screws holding the scales in place. Nestled against the interior steel are a ferrocerium flint and a pair of tinder tabs, perfect for sparking a flame in a variety of circumstances. Despite weighing in at just over a half pound, this SE is a devastating chopper. I've hacked and battened logs that should have broken the laser strike in two. Whatever we task it with, the knife came through unscathed. This is due to the thickness of its blade and the strength of its drop point tip. It's thick enough to handle drilling tasks while also coming to a fine point for detailed work or scraping. Mork Neve Companion Spark How do you improve on a blade as legendary as the Mora Companion? Simple. Add a fire steel to the handle. That's exactly what you'll find with the Mora Spark, a budget-minded knife with a classic survival pedigree. Let's start with the blade. At just under 4 inches, this 12C27N stainless steel model comes with Mora's trademark Scandi grind, perfect for carving and kindling prep. But where the companion models have a smooth and rounded spine, the spark leaves its upper edge angled and unpolished. Used in combination with the included fire steel, this is where the knife gets its name. It's an impressive, all-in-one system especially for a knife in the budget category. Like the Companion, the Spark employs a rubberized friction grip with a gentle swell for the palm. These knives are renowned for their comfort and stability in the hand. 
its rounded shape and subtle finger guard makes for a secure experience, even when wearing winter gloves. And, as far as the partial tang goes, Mora's been making them this way for decades. It's not a knife you'll want to hammer through a car door or a tree, but it's going to last you through just about any other sticky situation you want to throw at it. And, at this price, what's to stop you from buying a whole batch? Throw them in your car, in your camping bag, or anywhere else you want a proven, versatile tool. Top Knives Brachimo A specialized tool is almost always going to be better at the one thing it's meant to do, and while most knives on this list are fine for bushcraft, the Topps Brachimo is to survival knives what a scalpel is to surgery. The Brachimo is a Scandinavian-style full-tang knife made of 1095 carbon steel and is absolutely aggressive in its intended design as a brutal, hard-working knife meant to easily conquer the wilderness. Combined with a solid sheath, tons of small features that only an expert would notice, and a fair price point, the Brachimo is probably the top bushcraft knife for any outdoor enthusiast. With a 5 and a quarter inch blade that's around 5 millimeters thick at the spine, and an overall length of 10 inches combined with a weight of 9.4 ounces, this is definitely a tops knife. It's bold, it's brash, and it's definitely not fragile. The blade is made of 1095 carbon steel and features a Scandi style grind that terminates in a plain edge, with the grind angle being such that it should be easy to batten small logs or strip branches. The full tang blade is sandwiched between two linen micarta grip scales, each of which features a divot for use with a hand drill for fire starting, and a prominent lanyard loop near the pummel, which tops claims can be used for straightening out arrows. Overall, the Perkimo is an outstanding knife and is great for people who want a workhorse that can tackle nearly anything the wilderness throws at them. Hele of Norway is a family company that's been making high-quality knives for three generations. They excel at creating knives with razor-sharp Scandi grinds, which are excellent for carving wood. While they make several capable models, I prefer the durability of the Full Tang Utvar. Its curly birch handle is functional and fits very well in medium-sized hands. The stainless steel Sandvik 12C27 steel is thin, which makes for a very good slicing knife while still durable. All that adds up to a survival knife with a good handle, rust resistance, and great blade performance. Gerber Strongarm To label the Gerber Strongarm as the best budget survival knife is a little misleading. With nearly 5 inches of ceramic coated 420HC steel, full tang construction, and a rock solid grip, this is one of the best survival knives available in any class or price point. The Strongarm is one of Gerber's USA-made knives, forged with a proven 420HC steel. While this may seem like a basic choice for a survival blade, I found its edge retention and toughness to be more than adequate for extended use. And when it does come time to sharpen, the blade pops back to life with a surprising eagerness. This Gerber features a rubberized diamond pattern that manages to be both grippy and incredibly comfortable. The knife ends with a slightly spiked pummel and lanyard hole, adding an option for some light hammering or striking. I've used a lot of superlatives here, but it's because the Gerber Strongarm really is that good. For less than $70, this is one of the best survival knives on the market. Meet the new MSK-1 Primitive Knife from Ultimate Survival Tips. Known around the world for its incredible blade performance, stout build, and ability to adapt to any situation, with a rugged look and feel, Primitive is built for business and sports the key features and performance benchmarks of the original MSK-1, all for about half the cash. Handcrafted in the wilds of Central America by blade masters that specialize in forging exceptional knives meant for hard daily use, the MSK-1 Primitive is fashioned from tough 1075 high carbon steel, which is similar to 1095, rock tumbled, then clear coated with our rugged, oxidation repelling finish, MSK-1 Primitive is accented by rustic ergonomic hardwood handle grips. At 11.3 inches long and just under a quarter inch thick, this full tang beast of a knife tackles tough jobs like batoning, chopping, piercing and crushing, yet has the finesse of a fine carving tool.
The field removable handle bolts include the world's first stainless steel bow drill divot that is reversible for left or right handed use. Every MSK1 primitive comes with our exclusive 20 item micro survival kit that is designed to be stored in the handle and accessed by removing the bolts with a coin, zipper pull, or other flat object. Use the pommel end ferro rod striker to produce and accurately aim a shower of fire igniting sparks at your tinder. MSK1 Primitive travels in our antiqued multi-carry leather sheet that is designed for left and right hand carry in a high belt loop or low drop leg configuration. This sheath also sports a hidden rear strap and pocket so you can carry extra gear. This is the MSK1 Primitive Knife.